James won each here up in Perth. Obviously going one 0 down at half time, but getting back in the second half for point shared. Um, I think I would say it was a good point, but I th when they go to ten men, I think we need to try and push on and go and try and get a three. But definitely, I think coming away from home, um, a point you take it. What was the kind of message at half time? Obviously, we kind of came out and we were a bit higher up the pitch and pressed a bit harder. Was that the kind of message from Davy? For I think just ask questions of them. I think we didn't do that in the first half. We got in a couple of times, um, but I think their goal it's, it's lucky. I think Sean's said it's came off the, the guy's heel. Um, it's really unlucky, but um, in the second half we just we dug in and there was a ball over the top. Looked like nothing. Joel makes it something and wins the pen and Sean does what Sean does. <laughs> That's it. The hoodoo is now over in terms of the penalty kick stuff. Um, obviously on yourself in terms of the connection with Joel down the left hand side, you do look like you're really enjoying your football this season. Yeah, I think when you've got Sunday Joel's quality down the, the side it makes that a lot easier for me. I think I can go and, and not have to worry that he's gonna lose it. He's uh, he's such a big presence and you you look at the day was the fills he wasn't getting. Um he gets he gets obviously the red card for them. But I think it's easy when you play with somebody like that, he's he's gonna help you as well defensively as well and he's, he's, a, he's a good big player to play with. Three defeats in 13, um, losing Rangers twice, Celtic once, is it just now a case of turning these kind of points into three? Definitely, I think when you can also look at the old firm games, I think we've not been good enough, I don't, no, we're not shying away for that, I think at home against Celtic we were not good enough, that was um, when they go down to 10 men that early on we should get something for that game, although it's Celtic we need to go and get something for that game and I think you look at Wednesday, it wasn't good enough again. No matter where you're going, Ibrox, Parkhead, you need to go and put up a better fight than that, and it wasn't good enough. And I think today we, sh we dug in deep and we showed that we can we can play that side, we can go and turn it and we can go and get up the settings. I think um, when they go down to 10, no, we're probably disappointed that we don't go and get something else from the game. David touched on his interview about having a full working week. How important is that for players as well? Yeah, I think um, no having a game two day, every two days against Old Firm, <laughs> that's no bad, um, but no, I think um, rest, we've got a couple of boys that are out, um, probably gives them a bit of chance to come back, and obviously for the players that have been playing every game, it gives them a bit of time off, um, and just, we, we need it, we need to go and probably get back in the training pitch and go and see what we're doing, we'll look at Monday, see what we've done wrong there, and we'll try and rectify it next week. No worries, good luck. Thanks Cheers, thank you.